This video will show you how to apply topic analysis to any assignment topics you're given. The reason for using this process is that it helps you to be clear about the focus and purpose of your assignment and it keeps you on task with your planning and research. Let's look at this topic as an example. First, we need to circle the instructional words. They are the words that tell us how to approach this topic. And here we are. Here we are. Discuss and describe. Referring to could also be identified as an instructional word as you are being instructed to use a particular resource which is the Victorian Equal Opportunity Act 2010. Next, we need to underline the key words. These words tell you what you need to focus on in your assignment and can also provide a starting point for you when you start researching. The key words in this topic would be importance, equal opportunity, today's workplace, the Victorian Equal Opportunity Act 2010, measures, businesses should have in place, support and equal opportunity again. Finally, we need to bracket the limiting words. These words limit the scope of your research and discussion. They are also keywords, but by identifying them separately, it can help you to be clear about the kinds of resources you may need to find when researching. They refer to population, place and time. In this case, our limiting words include today's workplace. Victorian and businesses. So when we commence researching this topic, we know that we need to limit our search to recent research, the Victorian Equal Opportunity Act and the business context. So finding information that relates to 20 years ago or the Western Australian Equal Opportunity Act or even schools would be irrelevant and off the topic in this instance. So now that you've completed your topic analysis, you can start brainstorming what you already know about this topic.